Let's take a look at this very interesting aspect of hydrogen bonding, a important physical property. In those molecules where hydrogen is directly bonded to a electronegative atom such as oxygen, fluorine and nitrogen, you will see hydrogen bonding take place. Because those electronegative atoms will pull away the electron density from hydrogen and give it a partial positive character, it will make that hydrogen electron deficient. You can see in the middle of the board we have water molecules clumped together by means of hydrogen bonding. At the very bottom we have hydrogen peroxide on the left, formaldehyde in the middle and fluoromethane on the right. In each of these particular cases the molecular weights are very similar but look at their boiling points they are greatly different. Hydrogen peroxide is the only compound there which can undergo hydrogen bonding because hydrogen is bonded to oxygen. In the other two compounds hydrogens are bonded to carbon you don't have hydrogen bonding and the hydrogen peroxide's very high boiling point is the result of that hydrogen bonding.